will meet a generous amount of traditional Korean dishes at the first Korean family restaurant, Our Story. In World Food, we'll guide you to a traditional Chinese restaurant, Lai Lai, in downtown, where you can enjoy the real taste of Hong Kong and China's traditional cuisines. Sometimes, deciding on a family restaurant to dine out at can be very difficult. But don't worry, today we have the solution for you right here on Cuisine Korea. We invite you to a Korean family restaurant where you can enjoy a variety of scrumptious dishes. There are three franchise restaurants of our story, the Korean family restaurant. One of the Lotte World branches located at Chamsi Lotte Hotel and the other inside Lotte World. The traditional Korean shield kite made of hanji paper fixed in the lighting box of the ceiling adds to the calm and gentle atmosphere. Korean movie posters and magnificent pictures showing many memorable scenes of the 2002 FIFA World Cup cover the walls for your enjoyment. So, I think I'm a little bit more than a little bit of 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 어, 시간적 개념으로 바꿔가지고 에피타이저부터 음료까지 이렇게 다양하게 드실 수 있는 어, 그런 특징을 가지고 있죠. 그래서 결론적으로 말씀드리면 은 어, 우리가 약한 70가지 정도의 메뉴를 어떤 것을 주문하시든 15분 안에 모든 음식이 이제 나올 수 있는 그런 시스템을 갖춘 레스토랑이다. 그렇게 말씀드릴 수 있습니다. Our story has turned the side dishes accompanying cooked rice into many dishes. I cannot wait to see what kind of dishes they have created. Today's dishes we should uncover by Cuisine Korea. Our first choice is kimchi sambap. It's a combination of refreshing sambap wrapped in white kimchi and spicy pork. Our second choice we're introduced is Tubu Sobegi Tiki with this delicious sesame taste. These dishes were cooked by Che Hae Young, the kitchen manager who believes that the dishes served to her guests are like those for her own family. The first dish is what dish? It's a kimchi sambap. The kimchi sambap is a dry kimchi that 가운데 양념한 밥을 넣고요. 잘 말아서요. 거기에 같이 나오는 고기와 함께 소스에 찍어서 드시면 맛있는 음식입니다. 어, 그러면 한번 만들어 볼까요? The ingredients of kimchi sambap are rice, white kimchi, green and red peppers, oak mushrooms, pork and red pepper chim sauce. Slice a half cup onion into mouthful sizes for later use. Cut the green pepper into suitable sizes. Cut red peppers and oak mushrooms for later use. Let's make sambap. Add black sesame and sesame oil to the rice cooked crisply and mix evenly. Use your hands to mix the ingredients well. Now let's not forget the main ingredient, kimchi. Spread white kimchi and put some rice on it and roll it. White kimchi, which is not seasoned with hot pepper powder, should be used. Then it's time to cook the pork. First, put enough oil in the pan and roast.
when the pork begins to sizzle, add onion and rust some more. Add oak mushrooms, green and red peppers, the sauce, then roast again. Then move everything onto a dish after cutting the sambap into two pieces for easy use. Nicely arrange the sambap around the dish. Spread spicy vegetables, season with mustard in the middle of the dish and put enough amount of roasted pork and vegetables. The combination of red and green go really well together. Sprinkle sesame salt powder evenly over the pork and vegetables. On the kimchi samba, place a jujube cut in the shape of a flower with its seed removed on each samba for decoration. Kimchi has long been considered a must on the table for Koreans. It's so nutritional with all its inorganic elements of many kinds and vitamins. 두 번째 만들어 주실 요리는 어떤 요리죠? 예, 이번 음식은 두부 소박이 튀김이라고 해서요. 어, 튀김 요리이긴 하지만 두부를 이용했기 때문에 담백한 맛을 느낄 수 있어서 여성분들이 주로 찾는 음식입니다. 아, 그럼 한번 만들어 볼까요? The ingredients of tubu sobegi chicken are bean curd, pork, hanjang sauce, chorengi rice cakes, broccoli, and pineapples. Divide the oak mushroom with the stem cut into four equal pieces for later use. Cut onions, green and red peppers in a size similar to that of the cut mushrooms. Bean paste is the most important ingredient. Divide the bean curd into four equal pieces and cut the piece into three equal parts again for later use. Place the bean curd pieces on one side of a dry dishcloth. Cover the bean curd with the other side of the dishcloth and gently press to remove water, then sprinkle salt. On the bean curd, Place the seasoned pork and cover it with bean curd again. Isn't it quite similar to a sandwich? Sobak means food with relish inside. Aren't you curious to know when the prepared vegetables are going to be used? Fry the prepared onions, oak mushrooms, and green and red peppers and roast. Also, roast the small round chorengi rice cakes together. Add kanjong sauce made from boiling down soy sauce, liquid taffy, and black pepper in order to add the flavor. Boil down the kanjong sauce a little bit longer and the taste will be enhanced. Also add broccoli and pineapples and roast again. Fry the bean curd sandwich containing pork in hot oil. Bean curd abounds in plant protein and is low in fat. Fry the bean curd sandwich until it looks brownish and then cut it in halves and put them onto the dish. Place the roasted vegetables on top. You now can enjoy the tubu sobegi tiki with this sweet sesame flavor. It looks like all the dishes have arrived. 
and I'm going to ask her if there's a certain way we're supposed to eat these dishes. 어, 여기 음식들이 다 나온 것 같은데 이 음식들을 더 맛있게 먹을 수 있는 방법이 있나요? 네, 여기 있는 김치 쌈밥은요. 고기랑 함께 밥을 집으셔서 된장 소스에 찍어서 드시는 게 가장 좋은 맛을 느끼실 수 있고요. 그리고 두부 샌드 같은 경우는 튀겨진 두부와 함께 전 소스가 곁들여졌기 때문에 야채랑 같이 집으셔서 드시는 게 가장 좋은 맛을 느끼실 수 있습니다. 어, 그렇군요. 그럼 한번 먹어봐도 될까요? Now the only thing remaining for us is to taste all the delicious dishes. This is what I've been waiting for for the whole week. Some happy moments. The pork actually has a spiciness to it that goes well with the rice and the cabbage. And the sauce, it has a mild flavor, so it doesn't take away the taste of the original dish. Mm, now let's move on to our second dish. Here I go. Very crispy. Mmm, and the sauce is so good. Mmm, it's like the sweet and sour sauce. And the tofu and the meat it was very nice. Mm. Cooked rice is the main food for Koreans. It abounds in carbohydrate contents, and the Korean used to maintain their nutritional balance by taking various side dishes. The side dishes of Korea have developed so that they may be well balanced both in nutrition and taste. Each one of those Korean side dishes has now turned into a main dish in our story. Tangpyeong Che is made by adding many kinds of vegetables to the green pea jelly with this clean taste and then by mixing. Hot and spicy gochu galbi jjim is the first representative food of all Korean dishes and it has a spicy and sweet taste. Our story is tenjang jjigae with this pleasantly savory flavor. It's cooked by putting thin shell surf clams in the helpful bean curd paste soup and then by boiling it. In addition, at our store you can enjoy as much as you like a wide range of Korean dishes such as chonche yori adding to your taste and also many kinds of pot stews of which are so delicious. That is why foreigners, children and elderly like to visit our story. Nowadays, it's not easy getting all the members of the family to the dining table, but let's all make an effort to have a nice family meal now and then. Moving on, we have Look and Taste waiting for you. Looks good, tastes good. Cafe Hena is a cafe located at a residential area. Hena means the sun and myself. Once you get inside Hena, which has been modified into a restaurant from an independent house, you'll feel comfortable as if you were visiting the house of a friend. The antique furniture makes you think of historical times and the beautiful teacups please your eyes. The owner collected all these antique items. However, the thing which attracts customers above all else is the deep flavor of the tea served here. The coffee is served by the roasting. So the most important thing is to make the coffee the best way. The name of the coffee is the all that is to be seen around here is small antique items. Here in Hena, you can enjoy tea served in antique cups. 
The bubbles of cappuccino gives it a cinnamon fragrance that goes very well with tiramisu cake. If you have milk tea, a wonderful combination of milk and tender leaf tea, together with cheesecake with a strong but tender taste, the flavor of the tea is enhanced even more. The refreshing lemon tea will make your mouth even more refreshed. Hena's coffee gives you the deep flavor and fragrance of coffee brewed from the ground's coffee beans. The coffee served in the antique teacup gives an unequal taste and it also contains a legend. Hello everyone, I'm Gina Huang with World Food. I guess you already know that Ni Hao means hello in Chinese. Since China is such a large country, we cannot leave out their food. Some people say that China has so many different kinds of dishes that it's almost impossible to taste all of them in one's lifetime. Well, why don't you come with me today and start tasting those dishes. Lai Lai is a Chinese restaurant specializing in traditional Chinese dishes and is located at Pampodong, Sochogu, Seoul. Yeah, Lai Lai is a Chinese restaurant specializing in traditional Chinese dishes and is located at Pampodong, Sochogu, Seoul. Yeah, Chinese dishes use different ingredients and a diverse range of recipes depending on the areas of their origins. The omiji yang is one of the representative dishes of Jiangxi, China. Salted black bean and chicken are the main ingredients of the black bean chicken. This is a spicy chicken dish that once you taste it, you will never forget it. China, the color red comes to our mind. Lilac creates a calm atmosphere. The tables are always arranged neatly, and the various sized rooms are perfect for group customers to enjoy a meal in a comfortable and quiet atmosphere. Time to enjoy the taste and fragrance Lilac creates. Today we'll make creamy shrimps of deep taste and Shanghai style steak. My hands create Lilac's taste. Yi Gonggook is from China and a veteran chef who has a 26 year experience. 첫 번째 요리는 어떤 요리인가요? 네, 첫 번째는 크림 새우입니다. 이거는 홍콩 요리인데요. 큰 새우를 이렇게 깨끗이 손질해서 전번에 이렇게 옷을 입히고 튀기고요. 그리고 준비되는 야채하고 그 크림 소스를 같이 버무리면 그 크림 새우가 완성이 됩니다. 네, 너무 맛있을 것 같아요. 한번 만들어 볼까요? 예, 한번 만들어 보자. Creamy shrimps are created with a combination of big shrimps, flour, onions, peas, and cream sauce. The main ingredient is shrimp. Peel off the skin and clean, then leave them for later use. Cover the shrimps with flour. Make sure you evenly cover them with flour. The best way is to use your hands. Cut the 
woven into fine strips and place peas on them. Fry the shrimps in hot oil until they're crisp. While roasting onions and peas on the pan, add the cream sauce and roast again. Place the shrimps mixed with the cream sauce on the onions and peas, then sprinkle black sesame. The cream sauce is soaked deep into the shrimps so you can enjoy tender meat of the fresh shrimps. The creamy shrimps are ready to eat. Uh, when the beef, onions, green and red peppers, pineapple and oyster sauce are ready, then let's make Shanghai-style steak. Cut the thick beef in half and evenly apply sesame oil. The pineapple enhances the steak's sour taste. Finally chop the pineapple and leave them for later use. the green and red peppers and onions into fine strips and leave them for later use as well. Evenly spread the sesame oil onto the hot pan and roast the beef. Roast the vegetables and pineapple strips which will be served with the steak. Add the fragrant oyster sauce and cook. Mix the roasted beef with the roasted vegetables and roast again. Place the Shanghai-style steak roasted on the hot plate. The oyster sauce added to the Shanghai-style steak creates a very unique taste and fragrance. Now it's time for me to taste the dishes, but before I do that, I'm going to ask our chef if there's a correct way of eating them. 네, 이제 시식 시간인데요. 저기 어떻게 먹으면 더 뭐, 맛있게 먹을 수 있나요? 아, 네. 이첫 번째 화이트 새우는요. 어, 밑에 야채와 함께 이렇게 곁들여 드시면은 더 고소하고 맛있습니다. 아, 두 번째 이 철판 스테이크는 어, 소스가 참 진하거든요. 어, 천천히 이렇게 의미하면서 잡수시면 어, 참 좋겠습니다. 예, 알겠습니다. 네. 아주 기대가 되는데요. 네. 한번 먹어 볼까요? 네. melting excuse me in your mouth delicious 
it's not too spicy nor greasy. You can always enjoy Lai Lai's dishes of refreshing taste. I think that the customers would agree with me. I came to Korea and I really like the Lai Lai food. 正统、清口、色味香型俱全，我非常非常喜欢。When it comes to Chinese food, taste is more important than its color or shape. Some people say that each Chinese dish has a unique taste that will satisfy our palate. So, when you want to satisfy your appetite, why don't you enjoy a nice dinner at a nice Chinese restaurant? Cuisine Korea. This is all for today, and I hope to see you again next time.